go to CBS 2's Cara Finstrom. She is live in a neighborhood. That's the neighborhood where we showed that officers had weapons drawn outside of a home. Car, there's a lot of activity going on behind you. What could you tell us? There is. We're at uh, Lafitte and Wagner. Uh, this is, I believe, still in Oak Park. We were covering the fire, uh, driving between a neighborhood where there was one home that was burned and headed to another, and we saw a bunch of uh, police officers headed this way. And you can see there's Oxnard Police here, Ventura County Sheriff's Department as well. Uh, the fire department responded too. They were here for a little while. They've pulled out, and all they could tell us at this point uh, is that they. We're responding to a call, possibly uh, that someone had been shot. Uh, they don't know or they couldn't release to us what the Sheriff's Department found once they went inside. I did ask someone with the Ventura County Sheriff's Department if they could give us any information on this. Uh, and at this point, he said, we'll just have to wait because he's still getting a little information himself. We can tell you this is within the evacuation zone uh, and that as we pulled up, they waved to us to stay back at the end of the block and then they jumped out of the vehicles. And I think that's the video you're looking at now uh, with guns drawn, went up, went into the house. Uh, a number of them have been in the house. Uh, then the paramedics pulled up. They called for paramedics. The paramedics pulled up. Uh, some other members of the fire department who were here busy fighting uh, fires just blocks away. And uh, they've all been inside. So we're waiting here for more information about what exactly this is. But one more thing for these busy first responders to have to deal with uh, on this day. Thank you, Cara. What a